Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we're going to do a get ready with me uh, q and A. I I really enjoy doing these, so I'm excited. <laughs> um, but yeah, so if you guys want to see that, then keep watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more videos. I have a 1,000 subscriber giveaway. And hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every time I upload. And yeah, let's just get right into it. Okay, so I wrote down yeah. uh, five questions. Or I didn't write them down. I screenshotted them. Uh, so they're on my phone. And yeah, I'm going to start with my foundation. And as you guys can see, I will maybe not because of the sun coming through the window but i have quite a bit more color than usual uh we've been spending a lot of time outside <laughs> so i am gonna go in with a little bit darker of a foundation than i normally use this is elf and this is in the shade light medium and yeah so usually i go for like a light just light or light beige but in the summertime this is my foundation and apparently I'm out well that's not good alrighty so yeah. the first <laughs> uh, the first question is how's Linny's leg um, so her leg is a lot better um, you guys saw in the vlog of her getting her cast off that she, um, she wasn't walking on it. She was still walking on her leg like she had the cast on, but, uh, probably about a week ago she put her foot down randomly one day after walking on it all day. Uh, on her tippy toe and she just started walking flat-footed and she's been doing it ever since Aww. Um, and there's been a lot of questions about like the whole story of like how it happened and was it like a private trampoline or and I'm pretty sure I already mentioned that it was at a trampoline park but um just a quick little backstory on her leg especially if you like didn't see that vlog or something um we were at this is like when you're desperate you take the lid off um but yeah, we were at a trampoline park, and there was this teenager kid, I don't know, he was like 12 or 13, and he thought it would be a good idea to double bounce her. So that is what happened to Linny. Um... The trampoline place was absolutely amazing with us even though we had already signed a waiver like they really didn't have to be that good to us but we had already signed a waiver and nothing really could have happened and uh, they still treated us really really well and um, yeah I would when my mind has had a little bit of a when it's healed a little bit from what happened I should say we'll go back and I have nothing against the place they treated us really well the owner is bomb and yeah I'm she's she's all better and Brady and I are getting there <laughs> um Number two, why don't you make your giveaway smaller? So I've actually had a lot of people say that I will gain subscribers a lot quicker if um, I make the 
giveaway smaller, like a 100 giveaway or a 200 subscriber giveaway. And I, I don't know, I've just always had big, big goals. And I don't know, I just, um, I don't know, I just kind of wanted to do a big one, even if it takes a long time, uh, but at the same time, um, it's a very good idea, and I might actually do it. I'm not going to do like a 100 subscriber giveaway, because I'm almost there, and I mean, I don't know, for my own reasons, I just wanted to do a bigger giveaway. So I think I might do like a 300 subscriber giveaway, because that's not too far, but it's still far enough. So I might change it to a 300 subscriber giveaway, but I am going to take stuff out of the giveaway, because I think it would be way too big and way too expensive of a giveaway for 300 subscribers. Not that you guys are not worth it, but for my bank account, <laughs> it's worth it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that is that question. But yes, I've had many, many people ask me that, and yeah, that's my reasoning. Um, oh yeah, and I just went in with my NYX concealer that you guys have seen a bunch of times now. And I'm just going to put that on my lid, up to my eyebrow, and kind of use it as a concealer, but just for my eyes, because I didn't put concealer around my eyes. For some reason, it's not really blending out very well today. Um, okay, so then number three, where have vlogs been? So I have been doing a lot of sit-down videos. Um, I just, I don't know, I really like creating sit-down videos, but at the same time, uh, this is like not blending at all today. Um, what was I, oh yeah, um, it's just, it gets really, really busy when I'm trying to vlog the two kids and say we go to an amusement park. Um, I was never one to, like, whip my phone out anyways. If I have pictures somewhere it's because someone else took the picture most likely I mean sometimes I took pictures but I don't know I like to just be in the moment and I feel like a vlog camera distracts me from those moments they're amazing memories yes but I want to actually remember being there and being a part of the moment but I do want to start getting better because there's a lot of fun things that we do um, I didn't vlog Canada Day, I neglected to vlog Ellie's birthday last year, um, I don't know, there's just a lot of things I don't want to miss out on because I was too worried about the camera or the battery dying and having to go charge it and then, like, I don't know, it's just, for me, I just haven't gotten into the whole swoo of things yet, but I'm trying. I am trying and I promise that there will be lots of lots of vlogs to come and I'm just going in with my uh, Maybelline setting powder that you guys have seen a bunch of times before too um four Question number four, do you guys have your own boat? So, and the rest of this question was that they had seen us on a boat before in our vlogs. And the answer is yes, we have our own boat. Um, 
It's a Chris Craft uh, 1990 something. Um, but we love it. We have used it basically every single weekend since uh, maybe like a month ago we've been on it and we even have taken it out like during the week. Um, we actually so we did have to put some money into buying it but Brady actually had a snowmobile that he had gotten as a birthday present um, and he didn't want the snowmobile because it was more of a mountain sled and we don't have mountains around here we're not in BC or anything like that so it was just a really pointless snowmobile to have so he wanted to get rid of it and then when I asked him what he wanted to get rid of it like what he wanted to put the money towards or trading it towards he had said a boat so he found the boat that we have but the guy even though Brady's sled was it was only two years old it was a 2016 or a 2017 um, the guy still wanted money on top of it but Brady wanted it so bad that he put money on top of it anyways so uh, we've had the boat since last summer and we've used it I don't know like a thousand times more than we ever ever used that snowmobile so I'd say it was a good trade at first he was looking at speed boats <laughs> but then soon realized that a speed boat probably wouldn't be a good idea for family the family lifestyle so we just uh, yeah we just stuck to the boat that we have and we love it. We've actually been looking at like some luxury fishing boats, um, but they're really expensive. So that's something for a little later on down the road. But yeah, so yes, we have our own boat. Um, and then number five, I'm like already done all the questions. I thought I was gonna need just five because it's just a quick little look but I guess not um, question number five is more kids and the answer to this is we don't know <laughs> we're not a hundred percent sure on that answer I'm literally like not even telling you guys what I'm using but you guys know I don't have a very big makeup selection so I'm basically just using all of my stuff you guys have seen before anyways I think my face is actually paler than usual I honestly, I'm going to be 100% honest, I'm probably going to take this makeup off right when I'm done filming this video. Um, I don't like wearing makeup in the summertime at all because it either beads off or I'm outside and I want to actually get a tan on my face rather than putting a face on with makeup. So I mean, that's literally the only reason why. I put makeup on it's not because of my uneven skin or anything like that it's just because I want to look like I have a tan so that's why I wear makeup a lot in the fall and the spring and the winter but in the summertime I try not to wear much but I thought for this video and because of the fact that I haven't worn makeup in weeks why not but yeah, so, uh, yeah, like I was saying, we're not 100% sure on more kids. Um, we really, really like the two that we have now. I mean, we wouldn't be upset if we had another one, but we really like just the way our family works for us right now. And we like the fact that when we go out on the boat, um, we, we just have to worry about swimming and that kind of stuff like the girls we have like a, a bedroom a bathroom and a little kitchenette on our boat 
and the girls like hanging down down there like playing with the sink and on the bed and all that stuff so um I feel like we just like it because we can talk with all the other adults and stuff like that and not really have to worry too much about what they're doing um but uh I don't know I think I think that it'll probably just be the four of us at least for a really long time but we will we will see I know for a while Brady was wanting another one um, and I was kind of on the fence about it um, but then oh crap <laughs> but then I was the one who was kind of like oh I want another one but I think that's just because a couple of my friends had babies and stuff like that and then I kind of a couple days later it went away and I was like no I don't want more <laughs> Um, and I'm still kind of in the same place. Uh, I will... Big hugs! I will mention that I just put on uh, this lipstick from Essence and it's in the color Casa Nova so it's really pretty as you can see I've used a lot of it because that's all I have left but yeah actually talking about boats I'm just gonna throw this in there this is the result of this is just from like the band-aid that I can't get off uh, but this is a result of tubing on the weekend so that was a lot of fun I literally my brother was driving our boat and Brady and I were on the tube and we hit my brother was doing circles and we hit our own wave about twice we hit our own wave and I went up and when I came back down onto the tube, I landed on Brady's shoulder and it popped, not completely out, but it was popped like a ways out that he like couldn't open his fingers, he couldn't move his arm or anything like that. Um, and then this was a result from going on with my best friend and I was on the outside and I kept slipping off the outside and my elbow kept rubbing but then I also kept using my elbow to like put it in the tube and like lift myself back up um, like every time we'd hit a wave so yeah my elbow got pretty messed up but Ellie and Linny they did go on the tube for the first time so that was that was really fun to watch um, but yeah so that was this little oh boy my bangs um, that was this little get ready with me um, little chit chat and Q&A but I hope you guys liked watching it and I'll see you guys in the next one bye